Hey guys, it's Sandy. Welcome back to Cute Polish. In today's video, we're going to be trying out this unique curved nail art brush. It claims to create the perfect French tip on your nails with just one stroke. But does it actually work? Hannah will be putting it to the test to see. Hi, it's Hannah, so let's get right into this review. At first glance, this brush looks really cool. I was super excited to try it out, so I just sort of tested it on my thumbnail first, and I immediately noticed that it's kind of small for the size of this nail in particular, so that concerned me a little bit. First, I tried it with regular nail polish. I dipped the brush so that the polish covered a good amount of the tip, and then I just sort of wiggled it down the middle of the nail until I covered the free edge and swiped it back. Not bad for the first stroke, but then I tried going to the sides and it didn't work out so well. The curved ends leave brush strokes in random places, which can be a bit inconvenient. I tried it a second time on the thumb, but this time spread out the brush a little bit more to see if it would make a difference. It did cover a little bit more nail, but it still doesn't leave a super clean line. This time I tried filling in the sides by angling the brush and using the ends, which is easier. You will definitely need a second coat, and those pesky little curved brush ends will get in the way for sure. Not all is lost since you can clean up with a brush and remover, but I guess that sort of defeats the purpose of the brush. So now I'm trying it on my pointer nail. Since this nail is smaller, I figured it would work a bit better, but it's still basically the same. It does cover more area though. I got the same result on the rest of the nails as well. I think this would work really well if the brush came in sizes that would fit each nail because most of the problem is that the brush is a bit small. I think it worked best on my pinky since it's the smallest so the brush could cover more area. Now I'm trying it with acrylic paint. So yeah, basically you can see the same results here although the paint is much easier and smoother to apply so that does help. Again, it works best on my pinky, but I do still need to clean up to have that crisp line. If any of you have ever tried this brush before, be sure to leave a comment below. All in all, I personally wouldn't use this brush. My favorite technique to create a French manicure is just by applying some white polish to the tip of the nail, then making the clean line with a brush dipped in acetone. To me, this is much more efficient and you get that perfect French tip. So that's it for this review, I hope you enjoyed it. For more videos on Cute Polish, click these boxes, and you can click this circle to subscribe to Cute Polish for a new video every Monday. If you'd like to check out my personal nail channel, click this circle here. Thanks for watching, bye!